In the name of the Father, the Son of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and enkindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. O God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit instructs the hearts of the faithful, grant us with the same Holy Spirit to be truly wise and always to rejoice in His consolation through Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Glory, Glory to you, Lord. To you, Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, Suppose one of you has a friend to whom he goes at midnight and says, Friend, lend me, lend me three loaves of bread, for a friend of mine has arrived at my house from a journey, and I have nothing to offer him. And he says in re reply from within, Do not bother me. The door has already been locked, and my children and I are already in bed. I cannot get up to give you anything. I tell you, if he does not get up to give him the loaves because of the friendship, he will get up to give him whatever he needs because of his persistence. And I tell you, ask and you will receive. Seek and you will find. Knock and the door will be opened to you. For everyone who asks receives, and the one who seeks finds. And to the one who knocks, the door will be opened. What father among you would hand his son a snake when he asks for a fish, or hand him a scorpion when he asks for an egg? If you then, who are wicked, know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more will the Father in heaven give the Holy Spirit to those who ask him? The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, Lord, Lord Jesus Lord Christ. Christ. Italian. <clears throat> three pointers for today's gospel. Number one, today's gospel tells us of God's infinite and unconditional love for us. The Lord is ever ready to give us not only what we need, but also gives us more than we expect. Number two, as for us, are our, our faith, hope, and love for God unconditional? When we seek Him, do we really want to live His will? Or are we only listening and heeding what are within our comfort zones? Number three, with the Holy Spirit within us, giving us strength, we can live a more Christ-like life and witness to the good news of Christ in our daily living. Be assured of this. Pray that this will be a reality from today. Amen. 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 Thank you very much, Titaline. Beautiful well, gospel, beautiful lessons. Uh, in today's gospel, no, marami tayong ma, ma, ano, eh, ma, 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 ma reflection, no? Uh, number one is the unconditional love, no? Unconditional love of Jesus, unconditional. And then the power of the per, uh, perseverance in praying. Perseverance in praying. Yun. So, ask and you shall receive, seek and you shall find, not, and it shall be opened unto you. Very, very popular um, prayer. Uh, I think uh, Sacred Heart, no? Mayroon yan. Uh, Santo Nino, mayroon din yan. And okay. uh, Healing Prayer of uh, Saint um, Padre Pio. Itong uh, Ask and You Shall Receive. In fact, um, uh, the, um, during the... Um, during the hurricane uh, last night ba, yun ang ginapray ko. Asking you shall receive. Bala, sige, sige, pray. And then, and then I praise and thank the Lord that uh, my family, my loved ones are okay and are okay and spared from, ano, spared from the wrath of a uh, hurricane. And thank you for your prayers. Um, 
Amen. 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 A relation, there's still a connection with the gospel of yesterday, which is uh, the prayer taught by Jesus to his disciples himself. It's about prayer. The Our Father. I'll just read this. Sometimes this scripture passage can be misunderstood. Some may think it means that we should pray, pray more and pray harder, and eventually God will answer our prayers. Some may think that this means that God does not answer prayer if we fail to pray hard enough. And some may think that whatever we pray for will be given to us if we just keep asking. We need some important clarifications on this point. We certainly should pray hard and often, but one key question to understand is this. What should I pray for? This is the key because God will not give us what we pray for, no matter how long and hard we pray for it, if it is not part of his glorious and perfect will. For example, if someone is sick and dying and it is part of the permissive will of God to allow that person to die, then all the prayer in the world will not change things. Instead, prayer in this case should be offered so as to invite God into this difficult situation <coughs> so as to make it a beautiful and holy death. Yan ang sinasabi ng karamihan na we pray to ask God's mercy, compassion, but we can never change the mind of God. Okay? Hindi mo pwedeng in, yung mind ng God is nakat, kumbaga sa kung nakataga na yun. It's already made. So it's not a matter of begging God until we convince Him to do what we want. As a child may do to a parent. Rather, we must pray for one thing and one thing only. We must pray for the will of God to be done. Kaya nga, in all our prayers, it should end always. May your will be done. Okay. Prayer is not offered to change God's mind. Yeah, yan sinasabi. Prayer is not offered to change God's mind. It's, it is to transform us, strengthen us, and enable us to embrace all that God calls us to do. We reflect today upon how you pray. Do you seek only the will of God in all things and pray deeply for that? Do you knock at the heart of Jesus seeking his holy and perfect plan? Do you ask for his grace to enable you and others to, pull, to fully embrace all that he has in mind for you? Pray hard and expect that prayer to change your life. Amen. 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 Beautiful Tito Mans. So, if you remember, no, uh, a few days ago, uh, when I was asking for your prayers for the surgery during the surgery of my brother, no, and then, mm -hmm. um, well, um, thank you again for the prayers, no. And then to the extent na nag-worry ako kung bakit hindi ako worried. Ako nag-worry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so worried. Why I'm not too worried? So, <laughs> so open of heart your surgery. Faith and trust yeah. in God. Prayer, so. <laughs> nag-worry ka. Bakit hindi ka nag-worry? Oo. <laughs> <No. laughs> nag-worry pa rin ako. <laughs> so... Yeah, um, true, Tito Mani, no? Um, during, uh, when faced with trial, no? With trials, whatever it is, no? That's the best time to pray for, Thy will be done, O Lord. Yeah. Entrust everything to Him, tapos wala, wala ka na magawa. Mm -hmm. Thy will be done, O Lord. Whatever is your will. Kasi nga, as you said, Tito Mani, no? Uh, we cannot change sa God's mind. Hindi yan mag-change mind para sa atin. So, I don't know. I don't know. Siguro ito, itong God 
will not change his mind. Siguro it's a good topic for debate, no? <laughs> we don't know. Pero thy will be done, O Lord. And Tita Cons, you have something? Or Tita Bell? Tita Cons muna. Sige, ha. <laughs> <laughs> uh, today's gospel is about uh, the prayer that uh, Jesus himself taught, I mean, taught us how to pray to our Father. So uh, there's a lot, nowadays there's a lot of unlimited, uh, un mga unli ba? Unli call, unli... Rice. And, and <laughs> And lead drinks. And lead drinks. And limited vlog lagik para tayo ay makasave, makaminos, or uh, baga sulit yung binayad natin. But wala po tayong unlimited prayer. no? Like for example, some of them would say, ah, hindi na ako mag-rosary uh, kasi nagsimba na ako kanina. And I've been attending novenas, matagal to, makatagal ako sa church, so enough na. But uh, uh, ang sinabi dito is uh, prayer, pray without ceasing, pray persistently. Kasi the, the devil around us is not uh, sleeping. Uh, he always, uh, he's, he's, the temptation is always there every minute. Kumbaga, so the best weapon talaga is our prayer. So, yun ang, you know, no, we can pray naman kahit saan, not necessarily sa church, sa chapel, or sa adoration, but we can pray in our in our own comfort zone. Pwede nga sa CR, pwede kang mag-pray eh. You can talk, I mean, personally to God naman. Not necessarily na prayer talaga na uh, mat mata imtim, but uh, we can also pray like uh, we're discussing or talking with uh, with uh, God the Father as our friend, as our best friend, or talagang father siya na talagang lalapit ka sa kanya because uh, you need you need his uh, protection, you need his guidance, and everything naman po ay eh, lahat uh, that will be done. Yun lang lahat ng prayers natin should end by will be that. Yun lang. Amen. Amen. Oh. Oh, thank you, Tita Kons. Beautiful. Thy will be done, O oh Lord. It's true, no, we can pray anywhere. We don't if we don't have to go to church or if, if you are if you feel like praying, no. And the uh, prayers yeah. is only <laughs> just like yeah, and Leo. Leo. <laughs> oh. Talking to God. Oh. Thank you, Tita Cons. Tita Bell, you have something to say or whoever? Uh, I will I'll try to remember Father Tito's homily. Uh, the first was, uh, I think, about the prayer. And remember, he always say that uh, prayer is depending, one of the means of deepening our relationship with God. In fact, he spouses because one of his mentors, when they were teaching the, the young seminarians, that instead of the nightly watching of the night nightly programs in the TV, they were told to, why, why not just pray? Pray and waste time with the Lord. I was really touched by that statement waste time with the waste lord. time with the lord rather than uh, do some things that are not so necessary so pray and waste time with the lord then the second point that father tito uh, emphasized, father emphasized the trust, trust the trust that you display in one's life journey because uh, when we pray we really trust in the Lord's goodness, His love, His compassion, His provision that He will give it to us. But we were told that all prayers are answered by our Lord because He listens. 
However, it's not in our time zone. It's not according to our time. It's It may not be immediate, but in the long run, you will be given the answer to your prayers. That's what you said. Pray incessantly. Uh, be, be patient. Just wait for God's timing. And he, he really listens if we really believe that the Lord answers our prayers. All prayers. Verse 8, I think is it is it Matthew 21, 22. Uh, believe in what you ask and you will receive it. Something to that effect. And then the third is the grace of God is overflowing. It's always available. We only have to ask it from God. And he will give it to us. Those are the three points that I remember from Father Tito Swami. Amen. 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 Well, oh, thank you, Bell. Oh, very, well, very uh, overwhelming and, and uh, the graces and the blessings yeah. for us. Overwhelming. All oh, we need yeah. to do is ask. Yeah. And be persistent, no? Mm -hmm. um, be persistent in asking, but always end your your asking or your prayer with "Thy will be done, O Lord." Thy will be done. Uh -oh. And all prayers are answered either mm -hmm. instantly, or wait a minute, mm -hmm. or his time, or I have something better for you. Kaya nga itong sa gospel, no, no, no good father is, uh, is uh, will give his son uh, asking for something and then he will give a uh, scorpion or something. Scorpion or... Oh, oh. Yun, ang, yun ang God, our father. Or a snake. Oh. So, amen. 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 Any other, any other comments maybe? Peace of your thought. Pray unceasingly lang tayo. Pray unceasingly. With uh, with humility. With humility. And uh, and our prayers. With thy will be done, O Lord. Kasi that, 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 those words alone, no, na according to your will, uh, act of uh, humility na yun. Because we recognize his power, like we are really nothing compared to sa kanya, sa kanya. So, um, I think that's it for today's uh, Gospel and Reflections. Uh, Miga Belen for the closing prayer. Thank you very much for the reflections and food and the um, piece of your thought. Uh, dear Heavenly Father, may your light shine upon us, filling our lives with peace, joy, and purpose. We entrust our hopes, dreams, and worries to your loving hands. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 And all together, please, glory be to the Father, glory and, to the Father, Father and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, now is the version of the world without end. Amen. amen. In the name of the Father, the Father, the Father and the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you all. Thank you very Thank much. You. Love you, God. Bye.